Hi, I'm Peter Reynolds. I'm a senior consultant with ARC Advisory Group, and today we're going to be talking with George Buckby, General Manager of Expertune. Hi, George. Good morning, Peter. George, tell me what you do for Expertune, and tell me a little bit about Expertune. Well, Expertune is a software company that has been around for over 25 years, always finding ways to make the performance of our customers' control systems better and better and better. So they have these huge investments in control system hardware and software and our job is to help make that uh, help those systems run better and deliver better results to the manufacturing operation. What do you see as important challenges for manufacturers today? Well manufacturers are going to uh, continue to see pressure to do more and more with less and less. Uh, better environmental results, better financial results, uh, use less materials and so on and also do that in an environment where there are fewer and fewer people to help get that done. At the same time, I see manufacturers seeing increased competition because even in this environment of do more with less, your competitors are finding ways to do more with less as well and uh, applying new technologies, applying new approaches and adapting to that change. Uh, so to keep up with your competition, you need to adapt as well. So Expertune was acquired uh, earlier this year by uh, Metso. Can you tell me a little bit about what that means uh, to Expertune? You know, I couldn't imagine two companies that were more complementary to each other uh, to go through an acquisition. You know, we've had this technology that we've been developing over uh, 25 years, and we were in a great position to expand our market uh, globally. And along comes Metso with this uh, worldwide presence, and uh, most especially, Experts in providing service to a wide range of clients uh, and providing a wide range of uh, business results to, uh, to their clients in terms of process improvement, quality improvement, uh, control improvement. Uh, so the marriage of the two companies is, is just fantastic. I mean, it really gives us both a way to grow much faster and to better meet the needs of uh, this wide range of customers that we have. Mm, good. So thinking about technologies, uh, what do you see as are, are important technologies going forward to help you meet your objectives? One of the key technologies for us is what I'll call automated expertise. That is, all of our clients have mountains and mountains of process data, information about their plant that's not really being leveraged to help them achieve better results. Mm -hmm. One of the things we focus on within Expertune is to take the expertise of engineers, engineers with 10, 20, 30, 40 years of experience, and build it into the software so that we can automatically evaluate what's going on in the plant and provide some targeted advice out to clients. And I see this as a wave of the future, not just in our industry, but in many different industries to, to automate the advice. So that's one key uh, technology that's gonna move forward. The second one is of course happening everywhere and that is the ability to deliver information out to uh, people where they need it, when they need it, uh, whether it be on a tablet or a cell phone or whatever comes next. Uh, and that's another key uh, item. What we're doing is we're developing our targeted advice in such a way that it can be delivered into those uh, mobile devices, uh, really targeting many different types of users and getting them the, the right information at the right time to make the right decision. Okay. So um, innovative uh, uh, work processes and technologies. Can you talk a little bit about uh, how you see your R&D uh, research and development budget uh, changing to, to meet this demand? Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, innovation's in our blood. Uh, we've been innovating over and over and over and really leading the industry forward in terms of understanding what uh, control systems do, what they can do, and adapting to uh, what the client wants. And one of the things we've found is over the time is we used to think of ourselves as a process control company. Uh, what we found out is that we're really a manufacturing performance company and we've adapted our approach to innovation and to, to research and development to target a much broader audience of uh, personnel at the manufacturing plant. So we're no longer a process control company per se, now we're uh, working with operations, working with management, working with quality departments, working with uh, you know people on the plant floor, maintenance and so on, making sure that everybody has access to this great information that's already available uh, in their plants and helping them make the best of it. So we're going to continue to adapt uh, and innovate uh, for the entire manufacturing operation, not just for process control. So that really has expanded our, our view of the world considerably.
In terms of uh, uh, manufacturers, uh, process, refining, chemical, chemicals companies, they're becoming increasingly reliant on uh, automation suppliers to deliver services to help keeping uh, plants running. Can you talk a little bit about uh, the services side and help, how you're helping companies to keep plants running smoothly? Absolutely. And again, this comes back to the uh, acquisition by Metzo. Just a tremendous uh, service organization available uh, to us to integrate with the uh, services and uh, solutions that uh, Expertune has been providing. So we're developing a set of what are called the business performance solutions uh, within Metzo that are helping our clients identify their needs and also helping us find ways to deliver those in a very, very fast uh, approach and also in a very, very measurable approach. So we're able to go to the client and talk about valve performance solutions, control loop performance solutions, advanced controls, and process performance solutions that deliver to the customer a very measurable, uh, deliverable result. So, if, you know, if you want $10 million in energy savings, we have a path to get you there that's a combination of the technology and the services that will lead you from, from day one to the end of the year and deliver that uh, $10 million result. Mm -hmm. And you bring up a good point in terms of justification and return on investment. Can you talk a little bit about how you've adjusted your, your value proposition to make it easier for uh, uh, owner operators to, uh, to leverage your services and products? Absolutely. I mean, the value proposition is, uh, has got to be measured in bottom line financial dollars. And so everybody knows that. Uh, the trouble is a lot of manufacturers have had difficulty in translating from plant floor and engineering operations into those bottom line dollars. So what we've done is built these services around the specific kind of deliverables that you can measure and uh, a bottom line result. So when we talk about energy savings, for example, it's a great place to go and look for bottom line results that can be directly measurable. Uh, also quality improvement and production increase and those kind of things. So we're targeting uh, those kinds of improvements that can be made to the manufacturing operation uh, that can be measured in bottom line dollars and we're building that in right from the very beginning from the design of what it is we're going to provide to the client we're starting from that value proposition and making sure that they know where to expect the results you know, we're always about helping the client to expect the right result and getting them there and with this new approach to uh, solutions uh, and uh, business performance services, our clients can expect those results. Hmm. Well, George, it's, uh, it's been great talking to you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Peter. We've been talking with George Buckby, General Manager of Expertune. Thanks for watching.